Awesome with Autism show. I'm here with my eldest, Oliver. So this is gonna be one of a little bit of our series. One of the things that we like to do together is watch ghost hunting paranormal activity. and paranormal activity shows and videos and movies. We decided to do our very first vlog at a location here in Portland. So it's dark outside, as you can see. I have terrible lighting in the car. <laughs> and uh, so we're gonna go outside. I did bring my backpack full of gear. We did bring an EMF reader and some dowsing rods as part of our paranormal investigation. Yeah. We're not gonna do a spirit box because I have I have um, reservations with using a spirit box and that's because after doing some research on it, it's iffy whether it actually does what it says it does. I don't mean to ruin things for a lot of you out there, but you know, uh, books books that are on my, my shelf at home are from the likes of Carl Sagan and Neil deGrasse Tyson. So we'll just leave it there. But this is more for fun and this is more for the novelty of it, but then again, Paranormal just means something that is not what we would normally be able to measure or things that we cannot understand understand and use use science like explain explain it with with science and things that are measurable and are as a result of the natural world that we have come to know. We are here actually you can see the bridge um you know what I think I'll just why don't we get our gear and let's finish this outside and we'll tell the history of yeah. where we are. All right, let's do that. We are here at Cathedral Park in Portland, Oregon. You can see this is the St. John's Bridge right above us. Da, 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 da. A young woman, 15 years old, was kidnapped and murdered here um, in 1949. Her name was Thelma Taylor and she was actually on her way to a job on the 30, I believe, she was trying to catch a bus. And she was on her way uh, to a job and somebody had kind of enticed her and ultimately kidnapped her and did a bunch of terrible things to her and then murdered her. And actually, um, from what I read, uh, actually buried her in a shallow grave here in the park under the bridge. So you can see- It was called Cathedral Park. Right, well, well, let's get, we'll get to that in a minute. So they, uh, this individual buried her in a shallow grave here. And then what is that? Is that somebody? No. Oh my God. That looks like somebody like watch. Doesn't that look like somebody standing there? <laughs> it looks like there's somebody standing on that pillar over there, but it's, it's anyway, graffiti. it's graffiti. He actually turned himself in, I think. And then they located the body, exhumed the body, and then uh, buried her in a cemetery not far from here. Legend goes that you can, uh, you can what, what can you do? You can hear a scream sometimes. Right. And she's usually screaming, help me. And, help me. Yeah, things like that. And so sorry for the terrible lighting. It's really dark out here. And I don't have one of those lights yet for, for my phone. And I'm going to practice looking this way at the camera because I have my phone twisted the other way. I mean, there's some lighting there, but this is this is our setup. People. Yeah, that, yeah. So car noises were right underneath the bridge and there's a lake. Yeah, well it's the river. Yeah. Right. The river. The river. Yeah. So yes. Let me let me turn this around and show you guys. Okay, so there's the St. John's Bridge. This is I think uh, the the most northern bridge in Portland out of all the bridges. So this is the St. John's Bridge and then right out there you can see the water right out there um, and there's actually a dock that's out there too that we're gonna go walk on so yeah it's right there I see it yeah all right we do have to be careful though because there are people here and I think there's actually an encampment over there where they've got a fire going to try to keep warm so we just need to be respectful of everybody else that's here and I think we'll be okay there's people at the bench over there um, I'm just counting <laughs> who all is here <laughs> so that we can keep track. Okay, so let me show you. So this over here, this pillar right there, it looked like there was somebody standing there, but it's just graffiti. <laughs> Why is it called Cathedral Park? It's because it looks like a cathedral. 
Kai. All the all the pillars for the yeah. the bridge are in the shape of a cathedral. It's actually a very popular park, and during the day, it's very pretty here. So I think what we're going to do is go for a walk around here and take a look. Yeah, let's go underneath this the pillar. Is absolutely enormous. It is huge. Like, look at all this way, way up there. That's crazy. I can already. I hear, I hear birds over there. This is gonna be kind of hard to do a ghost hunting thing because. There's so much noise. Yeah, there's a lot of noise. Oh my gosh. Wow. It seems in there. Yeah, like E44. It goes all the way up the pillar here. Okay, I'm hearing sounds over here. There, I think there's people, there's somebody walking over there with their dog. Can you hear that? Should we go over there? I want to see. I want to see. I feel like somebody's falling down. This is. A lot of cars. You can, yeah, you can see the trucks up there, but. So many animals. Really, we just saw raccoons coming over here. <laughs> or cats. There's so much stuff. How about let's um uh, let's go out onto the dock? dock maybe? Okay, where is it? Shouldn't it be like over there? No, the dock the dock goes out this way towards this floor. Oh. Oh yeah, it does. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what, I scared you? Yeah, what are you looking at? There's open. something here. Yeah. There's a lot of rocks. Maybe yeah. this is where she was buried. Or no. What is? You don't, you don't think so. Yeah, because when I went to a cemetery, some people, they like, here? bought, some people bought a, like, a, a border, so like rodents won't go. Go in. What if this one where she was buried? Quit it. Should we do the uh, EMF meter here? You want to do the dowsing rods? Oh, yeah, the EMF meter. I, yeah. I've seen graveyards where so look, people had like rocks or fences. Turn it on here. We should just like. Do you want to hold it? Yeah, yeah. Let's go towards it. I'm not. I'm. I'm I'm also not trying if nothing. Nothing. Still. We got nothing. Oh. Thelma, if you're here, can you make this thing go off? Nope. Nothing. Okay, let's go let's go by the pillar and see. I would think this is where she's buried. Yeah. I guess not. We're not trying if we don't walk we're not trying to walk in there because if that's where she was buried. We don't wanna step in. We don't wanna in in her yeah. I don't know if you guys can hear the cars. They're but drif they're, they're drifting. drifting. Yeah. Going towards the same pillar before where we thought yeah. we saw a person. Okay. You got the EMF meter? EMF. Okay, Thelma. If you're here. If you're here, we have this EMF meter. If you can make it go off. 
and say hello. Maybe get closer to the pillar. We should like walk all the way around the pillar. We're just gonna and see if it does it. Dude. Oh, maybe it's over there. You think it's over by that, that pillar? They said that they found her body, like, in the bushes. Why is why is the camera blurry? Is it blurry? Seriously? It just went blurry right here. No, it didn't. It went blurry. Wait. No, it didn't. It just went blurry for no reason. He's on the tracks. Just saying, I'm filming behind the camera. Why is he on? That guy's on the tracks. Anything? Let's keep walking. Thelma, if you're here, please, can you make this we're go looking, off? We're looking for Thelma Taylor, who was kidnapped and murdered back in 1949. Should we walk on this side? So, I don't think we're having much success with our EMF reader at this point, so maybe we'll take out the dowsing rods and give that a shot. Yes. What do you think? Okay, I so can hear him. It's right over there. Oliver, here's the thing about the dowsing rods is they do also point to water. Well, so yeah. we we if, if, if you see Whoa, right it's going blurry it. again. Hang on. Why is it going blurry? I don't know. Yeah, oh my god, what is that? Oh my god. Like okay. The bridge. Okay. Oh, okay. That's just the reflection of the light. Oh my god. That's so weird. Okay. Um, so, what was that? Did you hear that? It was like a or something. Let me know if you guys heard that. I mean, there are raccoons here, but still, like... There's animals. What is that hanging from the ridge? There's some that goes up on the trees. Oh, my God. What the heck is that flying? What is that hanging from the bridge? Oh, you can't see it in the camera. Damn it. Can you see that? What is that? What is that hanging from the bridge? What the heck? What is that? Is that like metal or is that like cloth? Like, cause look, it's nowhere else. Is it possible that they had a party here? Or like, what's the last thing? Oh my god, what is that? I guess. It's nowhere else on the bridge though, and it totally stands out. That right there, right in the middle of my flashlight. <laughs> That's just a branch. Are you sure? Ew, okay, okay, let's get, a, here, come on, let's get the dowsing rods out. Let's get right in between these two pillars. Well, let's get the dowsing rods out. Because if we go over there, it, it, it may give us a false reading. Because we're literally on the water. So if it starts to point towards the water, we know that it's probably not going to work. So let's at least test it. Alright, so we've got these dowsing rods here, and... Go ahead and try to center. Let's try to center. Please center. Very good. Okay, I am trying to communicate, hopefully, with Thelma Taylor. Thelma Taylor. Please. If you are here, we're going to ask you some yes or no questions. Stop. I'm trying to listen. If you are here, we'd like to ask you some questions about what happened to you. Hopefully they can hear me. Um, and we have these dowsing rods that you can use to communicate with us. And I can see that they're very open right now. And we're going to ask you some yes and no questions. And if the answer is yes, you're going to cross the rods. And if the answer is no, you're going to open them. So if you are here, do you understand? Mm 
I'm still staying open. Thelma Taylor, are you here? Oh my god, that light went out over there. Well, we are under a bridge, like, that could be throwing it off too. Did we pick this? You know there's a lot of steel on this thing. Yeah. Well, on the water over there. Oh, what was that? Oh my god. Is this the bridge? No, I thought I saw something over there that just, what? like, started that way. Yeah, it just like something. No, it went super fast. It just like darted behind. What it was black was and it? darted. Black? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what it was, but there's like a lot of bugs here and everything. So okay, How let's tall was it? let's How put tall the was dowsing it? rods away and go onto the the dock. How th is that a person over there? <gasps> oh yeah. Okay, it is a person. They're moving. They're walking. Yeah. Holy crap. I really gotta try not to swear, but my son knows that I swear like a long haul trucker. <laughs> Quit where? Look, look, look. look by the tree. Which tree? Oh my god, what is that? Right next to no way. Holy shit. Oh my god, the camera's blurry. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Oh my god, what is that, Oliver? Stop. Oh my god. It can't, it's not focusing. <gasps> I can't, I can't, I can't. I can't, oh my god. Thelma, please stay. What is that by the tree? That's the EMF meter. No way. There it is. I'm not seeing that. Stop. Where's the EMF meter? It's in, it's in there. Where's the pocket? You no, know, don't get the EMF meter. We need like, okay. I want the okay, EMF okay. meter. Then we can talk to her. Hang on. Can you all see that? Can you see that right there? Say. The f the camera won't 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 focus. What was the camera focusing? Oh my god, what is that? What is that? Oh my god, my camera is not focusing. Maybe how about we go over here and Holy moly. Oh my gosh, that boat! <laughs> I'll see, there's a boat coming through right now. We should let it pass. That's a big boy boat. Oh my gosh, that's a big... Oh wait, never mind. I think it's just like a tugboat or something. Yeah. It's a tugboat. It's a tugboat. Okay. Right when we are ending the dowsing rod, we were trying to speak to her. Yeah. We see that. Yeah. Not cool. Okay, so now we're gonna head out, I think, to the yeah, dock. Yeah, right there, I see it. Yeah, I know. <laughs> we're gonna head out to the dock. If it's open, it they may have like gated it off or closed it so that people don't go out there. But I don't know. So there's there's the dock right out there. I can barely see it with my light. Okay, so let's take a quick look around and make sure we're paying attention to our surroundings, right? Yeah. Is it open? Yeah. Oh my God. I'm hearing sounds behind me, you guys. Like, I know that's the water. Is it shaky? Just pass by. Why? The boat just made big waves. It's Look at how big those waves are. Shh. It's fine. It's super loud. Sorry if it's really loud. <laughs> There's a lot of water and a boat just passed by. I'm gonna like quadruple protect my phone too so that I don't drop it. Me too. I hope this thing doesn't break. Yeah. I'm not, oh, going, wow. I'm not going far, but you can go. This is actually a really pretty beach. Yeah, it's not that bad. Oh, whoa. So, yeah, so. Oh, oh my gosh. 
I feel like there's like. Oh, it's shaking! I feel like there's someone walking behind us, but there's not. What? Okay, it's because of the waves. Come on. It's fine. It floats. It's fine. Come on out. Let's go to the let's go to the end. Oh my god, you guys. No, they haven't. There were people out here like a month ago filming. Oh my god, I just saw a fish jump. That was a huge fish. <laughs> that was a big one. Okay, come on. Don't leave your mother out here by by herself. Stinker. No. Well, they're not, they're not in this area. They're usually by like the dams and stuff where all the fish are supposedly gathered. Oh wow, look at There's the bridge in the city over there. That's so pretty. Look, go onto this one. It's a little more, yeah. Oh, okay there, okay. This is a bigger one. I mean, it's still moving. A little bit. Wow. Check that out, you guys. Oh my gosh, look how much it's moving. Yeah. Boy, look at these views, man. It does smell like fish out here, though. Yeah, it smells like the ocean. It's smelling a little fishy. Like well, we're a little far in. Well, we're pretty like far in to smell like the ocean, like but water. yeah, it does smell fishy. Um, if you want to, should we try it? The EMF meter, right here. Definitely not doing thousand rounds, except they people say, like, people say, uh, all right, people so say, there's the EMF meter reader. Yeah, see, there's like gloves out here, you just gotta be careful. What if there's a little bit? Dude, what is up there? Oh my gosh, I see anything up there? Yeah. There's nobody up there. What is, okay, what is that sound back there? I keep hearing like. Clicking, it sounds like there's somebody walking behind us. I, I, I have the feeling she's like. Like there was. Hold on. It somebody. blinked on that yellow. It did? A light yellow. Like it blinked right there. Don't lie. Like a little, like a flick. It went. Oh my god. Did it seriously? It, it was. It's not and that we're out, high. like. Oh, we're gonna have to swim. If something happens. Okay. How about we walk? Hey, look. Should we keep what walking? What does this say? Um. It says 19. 2219. No, it says 2219. I don't know. This is uh, 2009. Yeah. Alright. Okay. So it only blinks. Pay attention to the. Is it blinking? No. It blinked over there in the corner. It, seri like, it seriously did. Oh my god, what was that up there? Bird. Something, no. Bird? Bat? I hope so. Mama, can you make this flicker again? Please? Please? Thelma, use the EMF reader to let us know that you're here. Can you even just move the light a little bit? Just let it flicker. What the heck was that? It sounded like a. <gasps> I told you. Oh I guess God. the screaming Zorwheel. Okay, let's stop for a minute. Thelma, if you are here, use this EMF reader. Light it up. 
to let us know that you're here, even just a little bit. Can you light up the EMF reader in Oliver's hand? I don't think she's here. BSP. Yeah, I don't think so either. What, like well, that? they did move her body, so maybe like she went. If we do see, ew! There's oh my god, there's a lot of stuff in the water. Where is she? <laughs> You'll be even more overreacting than me. <laughs> I have a thing with water where I cannot see the bottom, okay? I know I'm Hawaiian, and I'm supposed to like the water, but you know what? The water in Hawaii is clear. Oh, we got the bunny rabbit. It's Thelma speaking to us in bunny form. <laughs> where did it go? I lost it. Your big head was in the way. Oh, I think that's it over there. It's like by the. Oh, there it goes. Okay, we just now turned the EMF reader on. And it jumped to. A, and it jumped to an after it did its initial like adjustment, it, it like it usually does. Orange. Yeah, it it jumped to orange. It jumped to orange, which is like really like way after we had turned it on. So we sometimes get like these weird spikes that happen out of nowhere and we think, we're like we think it's we're by trees we think it's a little bit shinrin yoku no. at eleven forty at night on a sunday it's not 10 so is it ten forty? Oh, oh it you're right it is ten forty. anything yeah, i, I think like the loudest there was like a couple Footsteps, here and there. footsteps that we were hearing, and then we got a couple spikes. A couple spikes from the EMF reader, and then the camera would go blurry. I'm just gonna set it down for no reason. Okay, cool. He's gonna set it down right there I'm just gonna on the bench. Thelma, so if you're there, do you make this EMF meter go off? All you have to do is turn on the light. Yeah, of course, like, when the camera's not on or pointed at it, <laughs> nothing happens. Nothing happens. It's hard to hear anything because there's so much, noise there's so much other, like, yeah residual noise from people we driving. More spot. That's the bridge right there, those lights going all the way across. Oh come on. The paint's like dirty in there. Yeah. Good thing I'm on a stream. It's not going off. I feel like there's like constantly bugs. <laughs> yeah. Even there's no bugs like around me that I feel like they're touching my face. Nothing. Nothing. Well, what Thelma, right we're going to go home. I think we are going to call it a day or a night or a vlog. We're going to head home. We've got some yummy snacks that we forgot to open <laughs> on our way up here. Dowsing rods prove to be ineffective here. And which is interesting, well, I need to research the dowsing rods when you're under metal. I don't know if that supposedly affects, um, or steel, I should say, metal, steel, same thing. <laughs> um, if, actually, wait, I'm gonna think about that. Yeah, so anyways, I'm gonna research as to whether or not steel bridges affect dowsing rods if you know leave a comment below um yeah like and subscribe to the channel too that would be very much appreciated um by the time this video goes up i will probably have done my first podcast 
uh, video, audio Maybe. podcast. Maybe. Yeah. Well, I'm trying to figure out, you know, um, I think uh, Daddy wants to do the first podcast with me. And then um, after we record that one, you can do the next one with us. All right. So speaking of, I don't know if you guys checked out my, my intro video to this channel. I was just having a little bit of fun and I was in kind of a quirky mood, I think. I was also pretty nervous because I have not told a whole lot of people um, besides like close family and friends, like very close family and friends, that I have autism. And I just started, uh, I'm losing my train of thought and there's a lot of noise. <laughs> so, sorry about that. There's a lot of noise. Yeah. And there's it's getting dark. It's getting dark. I'm trying to talk to the camera and it's getting dark. So let me finish this conversation in the no car. car. <laughs> All right, everybody. I hope you enjoyed this episode of ghost haunting with the ghost haunting ghost hunting with the awesome with autism show and Oliver. <laughs> so hope you enjoyed this first episode of our ghost hunting adventures and paranormal adventures and all those things. I'm losing track and I've got 10 million things going on right now in my head because there's all kinds of commotion going on. Sounds. I'm warming up. Um, yes. So let us know if you saw anything in the comments per every ghost hunting video out there, vlog, paranormal, etc, etc. Let us know if you heard or saw anything while we were out. It's kind of hard because there was so much residual noise anyways. We do have some other locations that we're going to go to. In fact, in a couple weeks, we're going to a haunted hotel over in Troutdale. Um, it's the Poor Farm out in Troutdale, which is a McMinimins hotel now. So we're going to be heading out there in a couple weeks. And then I think... Um, this week, we're actually going to hit up a haunted location in our own backyard, like in our town where we live. Um, there was actually a state insane asylum that was located there that later turned into a, a old folks home. Yeah. So we're going to go check that one out too. We got a whole bunch of good stuff coming for you guys aside from the uh, podcast. So like and subscribe to the channel. Share with your friends check it out. Um, let us know what you think. I really apologize for the crappy lighting right now. We are getting more equipment, but you know, liking, subscribing, and sharing with your friends helps us to get that equipment. So we hope you enjoy the show and we will see you next time. Columbia Cemetery, but unfortunately we think that Thelma's grave is so badly eroded and covered. Like, for example, look, this is somebody's grave right here, and it's completely covered, so we can't find it, and it's not a very large cemetery at all. 